In this video, I'll be showing you the step-by-step -step guide of getting OpenCV facial landmark recognition working in Windows 10. So to start off with, I have a fresh install of Windows 10. The only things I've done are install updates and install OBS so I can record this. So to start off with, I'll download Blender. Next, I'll download the Vincent model from cloud.blender.org. And that's down the bottom in characters. Next, I'll go to GitHub and download the Python files. I'll start by downloading the trained model. Now if we take a look in the operator file, it has the prerequisites. So here are the prerequisites for Windows. I'll open a command prompt as administrator. Go start, CMD, right click, run as administrator. Then change directory to the Blender install directory. Now run these commands. Upgrade pip. Install the packages. Okay, that's got the prerequisites fulfilled. Now I'll open Blender. Go to Downloads, Vincent. We'll allow the execution of scripts. Now if we go to our scripting tab, we're going to create two new scripts by clicking on the New button. And if we go to the GitHub repository, one I'll call this file. And I'll just view the script as raw. Control A, Control C, Control V. And I'll create the other script. View it as raw again. Control A, Control C, Control V and give it the right name. Now we have the two scripts created. We need to update the folder here to your username and where you have it saved. Uh, for both scripts you'll need to tick register and just go run the first time as well. Do that for the other script as well. Register run. Now when we go to our layout view, and on object mode we now have the OpenCV animation where we have the capture button. And there we have it, OpenCV animation in Windows 10.
just right click or escape in the blender window to stop the capture and then of course we can do some of the tips that we've got in our in the other videos by simplifying here reducing it to zero subdivisions and that should speed up our capture a fair bit Okay, just some other tips um, in the operator file. If it's not working, one thing to try is down the bottom in the initializing camera, increase this sleep time a bit. There might be a bit of time between when the camera is initialized and when you can start grabbing frames. Another option to try is if you have more than one captured device, you might try a different number in here to see which capture device is your webcam. Alright, any questions let me know below.